teaspoon of olive oil. I'm gonna fry it up. Now I've took about a half of an onion, chopped it up, and we're gonna add it to our sausage and let it cook. Ooh, that looks good and cooked. Okay, now we're gonna add two cloves of garlic, and then you're gonna cook that garlic in there for about 30 seconds. Okay, now you're gonna add a can of Rotel. It can be mild, hot, whatever you desire. Uh -huh. One eight ounce cream cheese. You could use four ounces, but we like it extra creamy in our house. What do we do next, Kim? We're gonna mix this all together. Okay, now we're gonna add in a cup and a half of spinach. You can do frozen or fresh, and I just got the fresh. Blair, go lay down somewhere. Sorry, y'all. We got our poochies just over here wanting a bite. Yes, and then you got an eight ounce bag of Monterey Jack. You only gonna use half now, and then you'll need the other half in a few minutes. I honestly think this is gonna be really tasty. I'd say it will be. Looks so good. Okay, now you're gonna take it off your stove, uh -huh. and you're gonna put it in a baking dish. goodies in there. It looks delicious. Okay, you're going to just spoon it out, kind of level. Mm -hmm. Have your oven preheated to 350. Now your other back of other Monterey Jack cheese on uh -huh. the back. I don't know what I'm saying. Sprinkle it on top. Just the other half of that bag. Yes, yes. Yeah. Sometimes I that's all right. I mean, we get the brain fog. I'm sure everybody does. Now you're going to put it in your oven for 15 minutes on 350. Okay. Oven done. Throw it in there. See you in 15 minutes, folks. Okay, here comes Ooh. our cheesy sausage spinach dip. And they said it couldn't be done. And we're going to let it cool a minute now. Before we can't we jump in? No, I think that's very hot, but cool minute, and then you can serve with your tortilla chips. Mm. Okay, now we're going to try it. I've got the thin chips at my... Oh, it might... Oh, but that looks... Dang! Now that's a good bite. Don't that burn your good. mouth. Uh -huh. Is it hot? Mm -mm. Good! Good, folks. You heard it here first. Mm, that is good, real good. Doritos that we crushed. And we've got a grease 9 by 13 that we're going to spread about half of these in here. Just spread them out there. Then, set that aside. We've got some rotisserie chicken that we pulled off, and then we're going to chop it up. Nice. Okay. Now we've got all that done. We're going to add in one cup of Rotel sauce, mm. but we got original this time. One can of cream of chicken. Gonna get it out of here. Oh, and we got some new tools here to we get our do. stuff out. We do, it makes it a whole lot easier. Mm -hmm. One half a cup of whole milk. Mm. And a half a cup of sour cream. And we're gonna combine all this together. And then I'm gonna put the seasoning in there. Just take this and tear this up with this jar scraper. And uh, we found this online. So this is a TikTok recipe. We don't know how this is gonna taste. Yeah, sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. But mm. we'll be honest and tell you. Yep. Now you've got ranch seasoning package and we only need two teaspoons of this. It said use four, but that's kind of too much. Like... So we're gonna just try two. Mm-hmm. Okay, and one cup of sharp cheddar cheese. We're using Kroger brand. They had a good sale on it, so. Mm -hmm. Get all good mixed up with your seasoning and cheese. Now you're gonna take this and pour it on your Doritos. Well, it looks good. It actually looks like it's gonna turn out. I don't want to miss any cheese in there. Okay, yeah, we want all the cheese. Okay, now we'll just kind of spread it out a little mm -hmm. bit. You're going to bake it 350. 
For 30 minutes. For 30 minutes, and then maybe the last 10 we'll put you on some more cheddar cheese mm -hmm. on the top. That looks good, Kim. Okay. Now we'll go to the oven. Would be even a good dip for a New Year's Eve dish. Mm -hmm. 30 minutes. Right. Okay, we're going to go ahead and put some more cheddar cheese on the top. Are we just leaving it in there? Yeah, let's just yes. leave it in there. It's fine. Just don't burn yourself. I'm not. We're using sharp cheddar? Yes, sharp cheddar. My hands are clean. I just had to take off my mitts. As you can tell, we're just, we're kind of innovating here, folks. We're just... Oh yeah. Just putting a little bit on top before we get it out. Because this so is gonna, gonna oh, it's just gonna melt. Give us a nice little. Uh, oh yeah, that's that yeah. looks good. And we're gonna let it stay in there for the last ten minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Looking good. All right, let's see this one. Oh, see our buddy, it's melted now. It looks nice. Oh, bring it over here. I just tripped over one of the dogs. It's okay, they're fine. It's, I don't know which one it is. Brand. It's probably mine. Okay, now we're gonna garnish this with our rest of our Doritos. Ooh, Ooh that's a really fun garnish. Yes. Yeah. But this will be good New Year's, having a people over. Mm -hmm. Fix this up and serve it to them at night. And we got a taste tester here today. Okay, let's get our taste test right down for you. I like this area over here. That right here? Good. Yeah. We'll make sure we get our Doritos from the bottom, too. Yes. And we can, and look oh, at that. look. And the garnish is just like kind yes. of falling right on top right there. This would be. Oh, what yes. the, Sam? The mixer fell off. Oh. Oh, that would be good for a. Tyler, I would blow on it a little yeah, bit, that okay? Is hot. It looks like it would be a good dip. Yeah, that's why I was It thinking. might be, yeah. Oh, Tyler, Tyler really definitely hot. blow on that because that's <laughs> steaming hot. Oh, no, you will burn yourself. Keep Tyler. blowing, keep blowing. Keep blowing. Well, we know it's better using when it's hot, but... Okay. Ready? Mmm. 